Callie and I'm a student at the University of South Carolina and I'm so excited to be sharing a read aloud with you today. My major is library and information science and reading is very important to me because I get to see and learn new things. Today, the book that I'm gonna be sharing is called Do Not Lick This Book and it is written by Aiden ben Barak and illustrated by Julian Frost. And I chose this book because it's all about germs. And thank you so much to Macmillan Publishing for giving us permission to share this book. Do not lick this book. This is Min. Min is a microbe. She's small, very small. Can you see this dot? Microbes are so small that 3,422,167 of them could fit on it. Give or take a few million. Microbes live everywhere in the air, in your intestines, in your sock, on trumpets, in the bottom of the sea, Antarctica, on elephants' knees, underground, in your breakfast, inside this fish, on top of Mount Everest, up Santa's nose, just over there. Men lives in this book. And if you look really, really closely, you'd see her. She says, I'm bored. This is a photo of paper, really, really close up. Let's take men on an adventure. See the circle on the next page? That's where Min lives. Touch the circle with your finger to pick her up. Boop. She's on my finger. Min is now on your finger. Away we go! Where shall we take Min first? Take me to your teeth. Okay, let's go. Open your mouth and carefully touch your front teeth with your finger. Now let's look really, really closely. This is a photo of a tooth really, really close up. Wow, this place is weird. I'm Min, where are you guys up to? I'm Ray, we're digging cavities. Want to help? Can I get some acid over here? Yuck, can you smell toothpaste? Hey kid, brush your teeth less and eat more candy. What a strange place teeth are when you look really, really closely. No wonder it's a good idea to brush them. It's time for men's next adventure. Touch your teeth to pick men up. Looks like you've picked up Ray as well. Where shall we go next? Would you like to visit a shirt, Ray? A shirt? All right, let's explore your shirt. Put your finger on your shirt to send Min and Ray on a new adventure. Now let's look really, really closely. This is a photo of fabric really, really close up. I'm Min and this is Ray. We're on an adventure. Adventure? Nice to meet you, my name is Dennis. We're making this shirt smell gross. I found a clean patch. Dennis, there's some lovely filth down here. Can you give me a hand spreading this dirt around? What's a hand? I hope we don't get put in the wash for a few more days. What a strange place shirts are when you look really, really closely. No wonder they need washing. Now it's time for Min and Ray's next adventure. Touch your shirt to pick them up. Dennis has come along for the ride. We have time for one more trip. Where shall we go? Shall we visit a belly button, Dennis? What's a belly button? Okay, off we go. Put your finger in your belly button and wiggle it about. Now let's look really, really, really closely. This is a photo of skin, really, really close up. Hello, we're men, Ray, and Dennis. This shirt is weird. I'm Ray. Hi, I'm Jake. Welcome. We don't get many visitors. 
Help yourselves to a delicious chunk of dead skin. Ah, uh, I do enjoy a nice drink of sweat on a hot day. Did I tell you about the time soap got all the way in here? I don't like scary stories. What a strange place skin is when you look really, really closely. No wonder it gets itchy. Put your finger back in your belly button and pick up Min and her friends. That was fun. Now I'd like to go back to my book, please. Can we come? What's a book? Let's put Min and her friends back in this book. Here's a good spot. There's plenty of room for everyone. Where will you take men tomorrow? The end. And here's a cute little page that tells you what microbes really look like under the microscope. Well, thank y'all so much for allowing me to share a book read aloud with y'all today. Thank you.